What's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today I have the day off from work so I decided I'm gonna grab lunch from a place that opened up right down the road from me. I found out about this place via Instagram. A lot of the uh, local fitness people that I follow, kind of my fit buddies on Instagram, uh, go to this place pretty frequently. It's called Bold and they're located probably about seven or eight minutes down the road from me. So figure I'll place an order, maybe grab a salad, a bowl, a shake, I don't know. I'm gonna go look at the website. We'll take a look together and uh, see what we're gonna get. Bowl Schenectady. There we go. Order online. Oh, there we go. Yesterday I was having a little trouble getting this to load. I wanted to see what they had see what I want to order. So I think, I think what I want to do, artisan toast, that sounds pretty good. I think what I want to do is actually do a salad. They have a protein bowl, romaine spinach, grilled chicken, salmon bowl, no thanks. Farm bowl, chicken, hard boiled egg, goat cheese, walnuts, that sounds really good actually. La Fiesta bowl, like a Mexican style a vegan bowl. I think I might go with this farm bowl. And then let's do a smoothie. And they got like six or seven, uh, actually eight different smoothies. A protein recovery. Let's be honest, that's probably what we're gonna get. It's got some chocolate whey protein, banana, milk, peanut butter. Turmeric, no thanks, not right now. Pattaya. That's like a Tropical fruit, acai, rise and grind. Ooh, coffee, almond milk, banana. Oh, monk fruit, no thanks. This isn't that monk fruit, does it? No. Cocoa smoothie, almond milk, banana, Nutella, maca, cacao, peanut butter. Oh, that's taking the lead right now. Matcha man, eh. Yeah, let's go with the cocoa smoothie. Looks like 30 minutes for pickup, order now. All right, so I'm gonna finish this order and then we'll uh, we'll head out to pick up. So just placed the order, uh, pretty seamless. It went pretty well on the website there. Uh, I didn't pay online. It said pay in person with credit card, which is fine. I'll just go in when I pick up and give my credit card and be on my way. It said 30 minutes, takes, probably takes about 10 minutes to get down there by now. So let's head out and just go enjoy some fresh air before we gotta pick this up. In addition to these cookie delivery services that we have in the capital region of New York. Another thing that's been popping up a lot are these kind of like fitness oriented bowl type restaurants where they'll make things like acai bowls. It kind of started a few years ago in Troy and then kind of ballooned out. So this is actually one that's down in Schenectady and I, I actually don't really do much in on this on that side of Schenectady where it is. I usually go more toward Latham but I'm kind of right in between Schenectady and Latham. So I figure this is kind of a nice little thing to do for a, you know, a lighter lunch, uh, just to hold me over until dinner. Just uh, gotta, I have a, a bunch of videos I need to edit uh, today. So I uh, figure this will be something nice to snack on while I edit at my desk there. My desk being my dining room table. So I just pulled up. I'm definitely early. I'm gonna wait for until I get like an order confirmation or something till I go in. But you could see kind of, it's right in the strip mall here. There's Ocean City Job Lot. There's United Buffet, which is like the best buffet in the area. And um, I, uh, it's actually a lot larger than I thought it was gonna be. I, it's right next to, there's Be Best Fitness, which under normal circumstances would be a perfect spot for a, a location like this. Stuff that like health conscious people can order to, to for lunch and smoothies and stuff like that, I think is actually a really great business idea, especially right next to a gym. Cause even in the area, most of the juice bars at the gyms are really lacking in terms of their offerings and stuff like that. So this is kind of a more solid menu, I think. <music> Pick up what this stupid thing. 
pickup wasn't exactly what I would call smooth. The, something was going on with the website and I even realized it yesterday when I tried to look at the menu and the, the whole ordering system didn't even populate, but they hadn't even seen my order. I had given it the entire half an hour. So I don't know, I, I, uh, I think they were, they were um, looking at DoorDash, which I'm not sure how their systems work together, but they, they, um, they missed the order. But so she made it while I, was, while I waited there, it took less than five minutes. I got my smoothie. We'll grab a sip of that before we head out. Mm, pretty good. Taste the Nutella in it. Before we dig in, comment below. This is the question of the day. Obviously, we've had to use some online ordering systems. Some, some of us call the restaurants. Have you had any glitches? You don't have to name the restaurant where you had any glitches with ordering, but what have your experiences been in this time ordering from places? Has it been kind of seamless or have there been kind of hiccups? Because this is kind of, I think the second in a row where it's just been the, the online ordering system just seems to not be optimal. So comment below, I wanna hear your, your thoughts as well. So let's dig in, got my smoothie. Again, this is good. It tastes a, lo a lot like banana. I, you, there's definitely Nutella in there, but you can definitely tell they didn't kill it with Nutella, which is good for a place that's kind of touting healthier food. So I won't knock them for that because I, that's obviously the point. You don't want you don't want to be Nutella is obviously a very calorie heavy thing. So in moderation, this is very good. All right, We've got our salad, and that this is called bold. So. The presentation is in a bowl, which is, I think is cool. And got the dressing on the side. Open it up. So we got our grilled chicken. Seems like about four or five ounces. Walnuts, corn, egg, goat cheese. So I need a fork. I need a fork. And it's all over a giant bed of romaine. So before we go in, I always like to taste these types of dressings before I, I go go to town on it. That's a really good vin apple cider vinaigrette. So I'm gonna go around the outside. I used maybe two thirds of what they gave me for now. It looks like the only thing, the, the corn looks like a grilled corn. Walnuts are plain, goat cheese is plain. Egg is hard boiled, but not, not overcooked. It looks like it's boiled just right. The only thing really prepared is the chicken, which looks like it's, it obviously was pre-grilled. I saw them assemble the salad. Let's try to get a bite with everything on it. That's good. For eight bucks, this is a, a, a very reasonable deal for the salad. It's a good little mix of things that they have here. Not complicated, everything kind of works off of each other. I like it a lot. I'm honestly, just, after eating that, I'm stuffed. I barely finished half of the shake here. So I'm gonna nurse that for a little while. Definitely a lot of food. Um, for nine dollars or ten dollars whatever it was that salad was packed with walnuts goat cheese corn chicken a pretty good value I'm, I'm glad this type of place is in the neighborhood it's five minutes down the road from me little hiccup on the online ordering but honestly i think that's a common thing it, it, let me know what your experiences are i really want to hear about it i will say when, when i went there all the tables were like stacked against the walls and they were kind of just set up for takeout they had quite a few people working there, a lot more than I had expected to see. So I don't know, I, um, they, they must be doing a lot of business. I, I did overhear when, when I was there, somebody from a local hospital there was trying to place an order, a larger type order. So I think it's really, really great to have this type of healthier place. And it's right next to a gym there too. So kind of, you know, good, good, uh, good little addition to my neighborhood here. Be sure to leave a like. Let me know if there are any locations you want to see me check out in the next Dairy X Dines again. And comment below what your experiences with online ordering. Subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell to get notified as soon as new videos are posted. 
we try to do one of these every week, you'll want to be alerted when, when that comes up. Otherwise, you'll miss it. And it won't be my fault if you do. I hope you have a wonderful day. We'll see you in the next video.